button, second matrix, edit A, enter. Just making sure. Okay, then you plug in this matrix step by step, one enter, one enter, one enter. Okay. It goes to the right. Yes. So you go one, 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 one. Yeah. How do we what do you do after we're done? Do you have all the all the button numbers in? Yeah. What do you do? Excellent. Okay. Then you get out of there. Second quit or clear. Make sure you've hit enter after you put the eight in. Make sure you've hit eight enter and then hit second quit or clear. Um Okay, and then you go to second matrix math, and I believe the first command is determinant. May I see your calculator? Sure. Thank you. It is. Okay, and then you go down to. It's actually B. You have to scroll down all the way through uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 0, A, B. What do you mean? And B is R R oh, E F. Robert is for. You are a clever little person. Yeah. <laughs> um, no, I am really yes, it is. Um, oh, I don't see that. Okay, then yep, you hit enter. Matrix. Enter, I'm and then you're back. At, then it should take you back to the home screen, and then you go back to second matrix name. A, and then you click I. And then yep. what do you do? Hit enter. You close, close the parentheses. Close the parentheses, please. Yes, second matrix. Um, um, to. Name A. Enter. And then your screen should look like this. Why did you say R R E F? It's R R. Oh, there's two of them. There's an R E F and an R R E F. Please use R R E F. Okay, so it's one, and then like it makes you make that, right? <laughs> <laughs> Are we sharing random trivia about ourselves? <laughs> okay. I know, I did. That was my fault. Okay, all right. Um, now, um, good. Amanda's got the right matrix. Here's what your answer winds up looking like. Okay? Now, Amanda, can you read that matrix to me? Um, it's um, one, zero, zero, two, Excellent. Um, zero, one, zero, one. Good. And zero, zero, one, eight, oh, two. Okay. What your calculator has done by a process very much like the way you would do linear combinations for two dimensions, okay, is it solved these, and here's what the, these answers actually mean. This means one times A plus zero B plus zero C equals two. What's another way to sum all this up? Can I get my answer first? Arturity, what's going to tell me what's another way to sum this up? Uh, I have a question. What is that? <laughs> that's, R, that's option B on your calculator. When you get to second matrix math, you go down through the When they run out of numbers, they start using letters. You see that now? Okay. It's Thank you. What's a much shorter way to say this? A equals one. A, uh, or correctly, A equals two. Two. Okay, yeah. So this is another way to say A equals two. Your calculator is saying that the second row is zero A plus one B plus zero C equals one. What's a shorter way to say this line? B equals one. B equals one. Good, Mimi. And then the last thing your calculator is telling you is that 0a plus 0b plus 1c equals negative 2. So c equals negative 2. C equals negative 2. So what this has told you is the one parabola which passes through those three points is y equals 2x squared uh, plus 1x minus 2. Uh, wait, how did you... Can we do it like that? Um, yeah, this is great. I won't ask you to do this without a calculator. We didn't do enough three-dimensional system stuff. Um, you see these rows here in the matrix? No, no, I mean, I got all that. And you have A equals 2 with A equals 1. No, this is 1. Th these are the coefficients of A, B, and C. So then all we have to look at is the right column. Yes, but I thought it might be less confusing if you understood what your computer was trying to tell you. Your calculator was trying to tell you. we only have to look at the right column. You gotta understand the first one's A, the second one's B, the last one's C, but yeah. Okay, yes. That will work short, I won't lie.
I'm going to hammer some concepts into your head, Jordan, not just processes. You're going to fight me every step of the way, too. Oh, wait. Did you like this process day? Yeah. Okay. I loved it. Yes. Now, there's also some completing the square and quadratic formula. We'll review more of that Monday. Okay? Keep this worksheet, please, because I want to give you more of it on Monday for the test. Today, the problems on the worksheet are... Homework, right? Yeah, let's say okay. homework and not do this right now. It is lesson 5.8b, and you'll be doing 3, 6, 12, 15, 20, 23. Is that it? And let me hand out the worksheet with those problems on it. I think they're hole punched on the least convenient side because. Oh, I that's use really nice of you. I use the copier settings of the person ahead of me without double checking. I apologize. Yeah, okay. Good <laughs> job. Uh, can I turn this off? Yes.